Welcome to the first part of the basic audio mixing and processing, different audio content for your video, video course of the Video Teach project. During this course, you will learn the basics about using different sound content in creating the audio for your video. The audio quality of your video is not simply an important portion of filmmaking. It is crucial for keeping the audience engaged and focused and guiding them through the learning process. The audio content of your video can consist of different sources and they all have to come together into one harmonious listening experience. The main audio sources are a presentation or a lecture, an interview or a dialogue, and a voice over narration. As we make educational videos, we should keep in mind that often the most important part of the lesson is delivered orally either as a presentation or a lecture or in the form of an interview. When recording one speaker, we would normally use a lavalier or a handheld microphone, and we need to make sure that it is correctly placed. When recording multiple speakers, they would normally have one lavalier microphone each, clipped to their clothes, as close as possible to their chest, or they can use a handheld microphone, correctly placed. In post-production, the recorded voice or voices can be edited using the audio editing software of your choice. To enhance your audio you should first isolate the voice of the speaker or speakers and edit out any mistakes. Then you can remove any unwanted noise and clear possible imperfections. And we have a special tip for you. Playing with the equalizer can change the perception of the recorded voice. If you choose the lower frequencies, the voice will sound warmer, whereas if you go into the higher frequencies, the voice will appear more present. Remember, the most important thing is that the voice has to sound crystal clear, pleasant, and compelling. Voiceover is a technique used to narrate or to provide commentary usually over some visual content. The voice can belong to a narrator or a lecturer, or it can be AI-generated. Often it is the central point of the audio, telling a story, conveying information, or providing context to the audience. When editing the audio of the recording, the voiceover can be enhanced using audio editing software. Many people cringe at the idea of recording their own voice for a video, and paying a professional actor to read your text can be expensive, so AI-generated voiceover is a good option. The greatest challenge with an AI-generated voiceover is that it often lacks the authenticity of the human voice. It also typically fails to understand the context and to convey the appropriate emphasis of a given text. So, when editing it, you should try and make it sound warmer, emotionally deeper, more human. Also, pausing can be used to add emphasis wherever required by the script. As secondary audio sources are considered background music, special sound effects, ambient noise, and silence. As long as you are not planning to try your hand at a music content creating, the background music of your video will come from a professional audio library. It can be free or paid, and online there are many options to choose from. Keep in mind that the volume of the background music has to be lower than any of the voices of the speakers in the video. It should not overpower the audio of the speakers or make it difficult to hear or understand them. Special sound effects can be used to make the video sound more realistic or dramatic. You can use sound effects, which are ready-made by professional sound producers. There are many playlists to choose from online. And one tip from us, special sound effects add to the expressiveness and character of your video but do not use too many of them because you will lose the magic of the realistic video, the one which feels natural, effortless, and authentic. While you should always avoid noisy environments for your video recording and choose a quiet place, the natural background sound of your location can add a more realistic feel to your video. Remember that the ambient sound should not be too prominent as not to interfere with the audio recording quality. Silence. Moments of silence, when all you can hear is the ambient noise, can be used in a video, for example, when making the transition from one part of the story to the next. Also, pausing in the narration allows your audience to reflect on what was previously said, helping them memorize new information and learn. Do not forget. Planning the audio of your video and designing the components of the soundtrack is of great importance. Clear and compelling voices, appropriate music, well-selected special sound effects, natural ambient sounds, 
and moments of silence can all enhance storytelling and contribute to the creation of a rich and immersive audio experience. Thank you very much for watching this learning video. If you like it, you can continue following us on YouTube or our other channels, such as Facebook or the official website of the project VideoTeach at videoteach.eu. All the content of this project has been produced through the international collaboration of nine expert partners and is funded by the European Union.